In this video, I'll be demonstrating how to program your Sprint Samsung Nexus S to Boost Mobile. I'll also be giving you a preview of our Boost Mobile Samsung Nexus S guide. This guide is going to show you how to fully convert your Sprint Samsung Nexus S to Boost Mobile. It is fully illustrated. There are four steps and over 27 screenshots of the entire process. Guide is 19 pages. And you can order this guide by following the link in the description of the video or visiting our website at www.pugetsoundelectronics.com. If you were to purchase this guide from anyone else and it has our watermark, we do not support it. So please do not contact us. We all offer tech support to our customers. Purchase our guide. So we'll be doing the programming, which is step four. That's this part. There are no pictures because I'm making a video for it. <clears throat> but every other step does have pictures. So let's get started. First, what you're going to want to do is go ahead and connect your Nexus S to your PC. And on your Nexus S, dial star pound, star pound, 8778, pound star, pound star. And you're going to want to change the USB section right here. You want to change it from PDA to modem. Okay, now once all that is done, just go ahead and go back and start Q excuse me, QPSC configuration. Go to start clients, service programming. Okay, select read from a phone. It's going to ask you for your SPC code. Go ahead and enter that. Okay, now you want to go ahead and scroll to the MIP tab. Now, if you have any more profiles except zero and one you want to go ahead and delete those you do that by selecting five first and then delete and go all the way up till you're on zero and one leave those there now we've written all the information needed on a notepad I'll go that information real quick with you you're gonna need your HA and AAA shared passwords for profile zero and profile one and your NAA <coughs> Or excuse me, NAI. I'm going to move that to the other screen. We're going to go to Profile Zero, select Edit. Copy and paste your Profile Zero NAI to over here. You'll want to change the HA and AAA shared secret password to X value. So we'll go ahead and enter that. Our guide is going to show you how to do this. Then you just want to make sure your primary HA address and secondary HA address match what you got. Ours do. We're going to select OK. Then we're going to go to Profile 1 and do the same thing. Okay, everything matches, so we're going to go ahead and select OK, change active user to zero, and select write to phone. You'll get this error, no problem, just select OK. And 
and then wait for your phone to reboot. And we can close all this. Okay, now once your phone is rebooted, go ahead and to get MMS to work, go ahead and dial star pound star pound three two eight two pound star pound star select edit enter your MSL code select others select MMSC URL let's go ahead and edit that I want to change it to mm dot boost mobile dot com. Select OK. Now go back. Let's go ahead and do a test phone call. Call six one one. So that works and then we're just going to go ahead and test our browser see we got the 3G icon and that works so everything is fully functional on the phone once the process is complete if you have any questions you can go ahead and message us through our contact page on our website which is at www.pgsoundelectronics.com or you can contact us on YouTube if it's a question, please just send us a message. Don't put it in the comments below. We like to leave the comments for the YouTubers and reviews and all that. Talk amongst themselves, not not with us. So <clears throat> that concludes our video. Thank you for watching.